Okay. Five seven seven six five five. A flat minor, which is going to be four six six four four. This right here is a C sharp minor, which is really four six six five four. But I'm playing a little different. I'm just playing a four on the A string, six on the G string. I'm skipping over the D and then five on the B string. The reason I'm using these awkward fingers is because I need this finger to go. So if you're just playing a song, you can just hand reach and just go. You know, hit that big chord, but since we're doing that other stuff, we're playing that awkward. This. I'm not gonna fucking explain this. So you just leave, leave all that shit sitting there, but now here's where the activity is in your right hand. So you got open, open, two, open, open. And these guys will be ringing out for it. So, and then come up and play the second string for me with your whatever finger. Come up play the third string. Come back to the second string. And then this is essentially repeating. Oh, oh, two, oh, oh. And then back to the second string, third string, second string, and then high string open. So it's like this. Is that good enough explanation of that? Yeah. And then, now you're ready for the melody. You ready? Alright, so. Okay, so B major. Two, four, four, four. The melody note is just the, really this fourth fret D string. I'm sorry, a D sharp minor. You notice that melody note is still sitting there, that, that fourth fret I was telling you about. So you could play it like this, but instead we're going to do this. That way we can keep honoring that melody note. And then we're going to we're gonna move that melody note up to six on that D string. And then give me a three on the G string. That's just gonna be a A flat minor seven, A flat minor seven. I'm just playing a four on the low string. Skip over the A string. Give me four on D, four on G. Important too. That's what we're trying to hear. There we go. Mm -hmm. we keep going. Mm -hmm. giant B major chord inverted all the fucking hell. <laughs> I love it though. It's like a B over F sharp chord. <laughs> You'll find this one awkward, awkward, but it's the best way to capture the essence of it. I, think. So I got a two on the low string. It's really weird. Six on the A string, and then four on the D, and a four on the G string. And then when you play all four of those notes, and then da, da, melody wise, we're playing the D string without the middle finger. Tasty. Mm -hmm. Keep going? Yep. Okay, here I've got an F sharp minor over E chord. This is going to be four on the D string, two on the G string, two on the B string, with an open string. So it's like F sharp over E. Melody's on the D string in this, I'm noticing. Ooh. Tasty. C 
sharp minor, I don't even know what the hell. I'm calling this F sharp minor nine. Weirdness. Cluster chord, but but suits the melody great. This chord, I'm, I'm gonna do two on the low string, four on the A string, four on the A string, two on the D string, one on the G string. Yeah. Now we got melody notes, four and two on the A string. Almost through. Flat minor, 466444. Six, four, four, four. But it's kind of weird. We're doing essentially like a hammer on four to six on the A string. And that's the melody. And then a little melody with octaves. And that's going to be a four six slide back to two four. West out. You still got you running out? No. And then. Now here we got five on the low string octave here, we got four on the A, six on the, and then right there it's time to catch it, that little thing, it's a, and during the verses you can actually play the full uh, C sharp minor chord, not that weird one. I'd like to make is when I had you play this weird ass F sharp minor nine. The two, four, two, one. I also like the, the B string wide open, I just noticed in there because it gives more color. Mm -hmm. It's like a minor 11. A weird chord. Yeah. that last time around yeah you saw on the last time so you do three of those three of those in a row and on the fourth time Ooh, let's taste okay so here's the fourth time around b and then c uh d sharp minor seven you get six four six but what i'm doing here is d trying to slide there from three to four on the uh, B string. So. Yeah. And then we're going to grab hammer while those other notes sit there on the B, uh, G string, G string, third string. Hammer four to six. And then an A flat minor. Four, six, six, four. get that and then you're to the chorus then we can stop it and this is going to be uh, specifically it's a flat minor but we're going to this time instead of a big full one like that we're just going to go like this four on the low string skip over the a and d string give me four and four on the g and b strings and just play those three strings and then while these two guys still ringing out give me a two on the b string with the high string open and then same two strings this time four and two see four on the second string two on the first string and those these two guys are still stationary so sentence of that thing so you gotta finish that there's nothing right mm -hmm. which
which comes off this thing in the beginning of the song. That's what you're trying to 